Oh yeah, it's here. Oh yeah, it's here. It's a little great. It's a little great. Let's not jumble that too much. What's up everybody? It's Corey and I'm back with another awesome video for you guys. Today, I'm gonna be unboxing this month's Loot Crate. This is the seventh crate that I've picked up. I've got one every month this year and I definitely plan on getting one until the end of the year and all the way through the future. Definitely worth the money. All right, so I don't wanna waste too much time. Let's go ahead and get into this month's Hero 2 theme loot crate hopefully this will have some goodies inside let's get this sucker open and <gasps> what do we got here first thing i see this is this is amazing so we got a q pop classic tv series batman figurine it says get other great dc comic q pop figurines that have a superman and they also have a catwoman but this is the loot crate exclusive batman q pop figurine that is that is sick that is awesome definitely not gonna open that that's gonna stay right in that box and we're gonna find some space back here to put that na 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 batman Ooh, this is awesome. So we got a Batman keychain. We got a Batman keychain here. It's a multi-tool. It has like a bottle opener on it and it's a keychain. Definitely gonna put that on my keys right next to my little Raphael. Put him next to Raph. Right. Oh, cool, cool, cool. We have a Star Trek air freshener. Put that up in the, in the VIP. Well, riding clean. Truckied up. Yeah, I can do it. I can do it. Uh, uh. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that's. Smells pretty good. <gasps> Loot Crate exclusive Legend of Zelda wristband. Awesome. I've been like wanting to get a wristband lately, so that's cool. Loot Crate, you already. You know how to read me so well. Every month I get something that's like, thank you. What is in this? Oh, we have a poster. Hmm. Let's check what this is. Oh, that's cool. She can do it. Get like a 1940s style World War II, uh, you know, type, type flyer, except it's Wonder Woman breaking the chains. I know you feminists out there will love that. Might have to give that to Shayna, right? She can, she can dig it. She can dig it. So that's cool. Loot Crate is an equal opportunity uh, provider as well. So <laughs> and make sure there's stuff for everybody in there. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. We have our pin for the month. Loot Crate, July 2015. Heroes 2, and it's kind of like Batman out there, but it's not Batman for legal purposes but as you can kind of see it's like batman with the uh bat signal up there except it's not a bat for legal purposes so that's cool what's going on the jacket almost almost done here guys um we have the what is this bra brawlhalla white fang nash ganache legend skin long tooth spear skin howling skull hammer skin nash Legend unlock a full version of the new platform fighter Brawlhalla. Um, okay, well, I don't do PC gaming as of right now. My computer can't really uh, stream that. So if you guys, first person to type that code in, there you go. You can um, download Brawlhalla and all that cool stuff for you uh, PC master racers out there. Sometimes in Loot Crate, instead of getting a t-shirt, you get a cool piece of literature, you get a book, and last time, instead of a shirt, they gave me Ready Player One, which is awesome. Uh, it was definitely a great read, and this time, they gave us The League of Regrettable Superheroes by John Morris, and um, this is the Loot Crate edition. It says on the back, look up in the sky, it's a bee, it's a witch, 
it's a giant eyeball. So we know about a bunch of different superheroes and this is basically a book just uh, about all the forgettable superheroes that we may have forgotten over the time. And there's a bunch of people in here. Um, the Bouncer, just so randomly. Um, Lollapalooza, Mickey Finn, Doll Man, Madame Fatal, Nightmare and Sleepy. You know, just a bunch of different comics I'd never heard of Spider Queen I just saw. So it's really cool. It's gonna be cool to flip through that, see a lot of things that didn't really make it through the test of time. And finally, we have the Loot Crate magazine that basically wraps up, lets you know everything that was in the crate, um, what things do. We got some uh, advertisement here for PAX, uh, PAX Prime. That's cool. Fallout 4, limited edition crate. What? Coming so What? Oh my god, what? Hey Vault Dwellers, we're so excited about Fallout 4 that we're putting together a specialty crate pack with some rare exclusive Fallout wearables and collectibles. We'll be sending out an email with more details soon, so crack open a Nuka Cola and keep your eyes on your pit boy. What? I'm glad I read this and didn't just skim over this because there's going to be an exclusive Fallout crate. If you're not hyped for Fallout 4, there's something wrong with you guys, literally. Oh, and that's cool. We also know that the uh, box folds up, you know, it appears to be like some sort of haunted, haunted Joker house or whatever. I could put it together, but you guys got to order Loot Crate, put it together yourselves, you know. Um, like I said, Loot Crate is definitely awesome, worth the bucks, um, about 20 bucks a month or whatever, unless you get the yearly subscription, then it's a little bit cheaper, but definitely worth every penny. What did you guys think about this month's Heroes 2 Crate? Let me know down in the comments below. If you like this video, make sure you give me a thumbs up. If you didn't, I guess you give us a thumbs down. Any response works for me. Other than that, guys, I'm Corey, and I'm out of here. Peace.